Hey there guys, Demo73 here bringing you the second deck profile of the day. This is for Nyx Blue Black Moon Gilapis Control, so let's just dig right in. Conqueror of the Black Moon Gilapis is our ruler, has a judgment of Black Moon Colorless, and while he's on this side, uh, Regalia costs one more to activate for your opponent. That becomes Primogenitor Gilapis. Uh, when he comes into play, you get to pull a black Pitch Black Moon from your deck, put it on the field. Uh, for a moon, he can cancel target activate ability, and for dark and one, um, you can give something minus two, minus two. God's art is black, blue, uh, moon, two colorless. You get to steal a, an addition field, a regalia, and a resonator from your opponent's deck. All or any or none, and just put them right onto your field. Really, really strong, plus for a 12-12 base stat, uh, and with his moon of 14-14, very strong Jade Ruler. Going into the stones, uh... Four Black Moons Memoria, four Dark Depths to get that blue, uh, and then two Moon Shade to also get some more blue out of it, as well as the Moon. Gonna quickly go through the Resonators here. We have the four Cheshire Cat for draw power and chump blocking. Uh, two Izanami to be able to have a smaller creature on board, uh, as well as a body to block with, um, and some more discard outlet for your opponent. Uh, four Lucifer. Uh, does run four Lucifers. Um, Nick is currently borrowing two more of them, so that's why I only have the two, but it does run four Lucifers. That's so kind of the big heavy hitter. Makes them sacrifice creatures, gives you lifelink, uh, pass flying, really, really strong card. Um, we are playing uh, some bigger heavy hitters as well with Mephistopheles, the Abyssal Tyrant. Uh, uh, flying and target attack 15-15, really, really strong and forces your opponent to take burn damage. And then to steal your opponent's stuff, one Valentina Puppet Monarch, and to boost up all of your guys. Uh, it does eliminate your treasures, but you don't play a ton of creatures, so it's not a big deal. Um, the one of Arthur, the uh, Dread Lord of Vengeance, to pump, pump things up. Regalia-wise, uh, four Swiftness to be able to make Lapis as fast as possible, and two Death Scythe to be able to mess with your opponent's Shade Rulers easier. Spell lineup wise, we run four of Soul Hunt because you don't run a ton of creatures, so it's not a big deal. Uh, and you can make your opponent sack and discard stuff. Three Stoning to Death to deal with those heavy creatures. Uh, some more early game discard package with Scorn of Dark Alice. Some more uh, J Ruler Hate specifically with uh, Space Time Anomaly, also is draw power, which is nice. Two space time collapse to take advantage of the fact that we have Gil Lapis to pop a resonator and a regalia. Two spiral of despair for some more discard energy. And then two spirals to stack with Primo and two of his moon just because you don't want to draw your one and then be stuck not being able to grab anything off the judgment. So that is the list. I know that was kind of quick, but let me know what you guys thought in the comment sections down below, what you would change, what you like about the list, and uh, like, comment, and subscribe as always. And until next time, this is DMO73 signing off.